And I don't get like this until I done being nice already. I done been nice. Now I ain't got time to be nice no more. Now it's like, fuck that. Because sometimes, you know, certain people, they only could hear that disrespectful shit. They can't hear respectful shit. They can't hear when you trying to be nice. They can't hear when you trying to be, you know, uh, concerned or... or, or respectable of they feelings and shit. Like, now nah, it's like, fuck your feelings because at the end of the day, it's like, your feelings ain't logical. Your feelings ain't making sense. You know what I'm saying? The way you feel ain't even making sense based on reality for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, make that shit make sense, dog. And then it's crazy because me and Bae, we, we be doing some, we be doing some opposite ass shit. When I'm turned up like this and I'm on a bitch neck, she be like, chill, babe, don't do it like that. But when she on a bitch neck, I be like, chill, babe, don't do it like that. <laughs> like, we be like trying to save a bitch all the time. So in other words, you could talk to a hoe with respect, but the hoe go feel disrespected. But if you talk to this bitch disrespectfully, she go feel like you just talk to her like a queen. Go figure. Like, and I ain't dealing with them dumb bitches like that no more, bro. Straight up. At the end of the day, if I told my girl last night, I was like, bro, we got to stop calling each other my nigga and my bitch. Like, you ain't my bitch. You my wife. You my lady. You my queen. I ain't your nigga. Don't call me your nigga. Like, if you call me your nigga, I'm not going to respond to that shit. I'm going to act like I'm not even there. I'm your man or your husband. You my wife or my woman. Period. We ain't doing that lame ass shit no more. Or it's bae. Period, point blank. That's mainly the one. That's mainly the one we use, anyways. Either Bay or I might call her Mama, or she might call me Papa Cito. But we ain't doing that, my nigga and my bitch shit. That shit dead. Y'all need to take that shit out y'all vocabulary. If y'all in a relationship for real, that shit is disrespectful. I don't give a fuck what context you use it in. Hey man, I'm just put it to y'all like this. Y'all better go ahead and get right and get ready to enroll in this coaching. Because I'm going to be coaching people to victory. I'm about to coach y'all to the best lives y'all ever had. I want to I wanna really help y'all for real. Single moms, single women, single dudes, couples, business owners, future business owners, people that, you know, struggle with mental battles and shit. Bring it all to me, bro. I'm going to really coach your ass to a victory. You going to feel like Jordan and... All the game sixes, god damn it. You gonna feel like Jordan, 6-0 in the finals. I'm telling you, you come over here and fuck with this shit. This shit gonna be better than what you ever experienced. But like I said, y'all gonna have to sign up for the Patreon first. Then y'all gonna have to watch the videos and really make sure this is what y'all want. Because when I start coaching y'all, I'm gonna be calling your phone. I'm gonna be texting your phone. I'm gonna be holding you accountable. I'm gonna be making sure.